can't believe it. After all this time, we still aren't yet at. Welcome back to New Sakura Wars. I'm your host, Ultra Director Jester, with the Niskull. Wait, weren't we just at the games? Yeah, but then that terrorist attack happened, uh -huh. and now, and th now there's a delay. Oh. So, first of all, we're not gonna be fighting in the games yet. It's still we're still not doing any fighting yet. We're still not doing any games part of the games yet. They're teasing us. Don't you want to play the games? Oh, so now it's... Sakura. Sakura is going to voice who she believes the culprit might be. Alright, is she going to have an existential crisis? It's Sakura Shinguji! Oh my god, it's such a plot twist! You know, Sega, this would be a bigger plot twist if you actually released the rest of the Sakura Wars games over here in the West! Yeah, so we're all like, huh, uh, who? <laughs> She was she wasn't in five, right? I'm not crazy. She was like in the opening chapter of five. That's oh, it. Okay, that's what I thought. She's basically there to see us off to go to America, along with uh, Ogami. So why do we care now? We don't. Okay, as long as we're on the same page. So Sakura thinks that it's Sakura, but Sumeri says it's not Sakura. So, which one is it? Uh. Thank God we didn't start a counter for the amount of times we say, Sakura. So here we go. We're gonna talk about Shadow Tokyo now. Uh, excuse me? Operation Twin Capitals. <laughs> what? This is... Oh my God. Oh, backstory! This explains why none of the other protagonists are here, right? Kind of. Okay. Got an arch demon, that's a good start. So they created an alternative version of the city, Shadow Tokyo. How did they create it? What, did that, what do you mean by create? How did you create it? What makes it shadow? Did you just highlight all and hit copy? Did you all build it? Wait, so we created the Shadow Tokyo to basically trick the Archdemon into going to the wrong party? Yeah, and then all of the fucking <laughs> review char- all the characters from Sakura Wars 1 through 5 went there, and now they're trapped in Shadow Tokyo, fighting an endless hellish landscape war for 10 years, and nobody gives a shit! Wait a minute, so that's a- that's cause for- of, like- our incompetence! We sent them to the wrong party! Did everyone raise their arms to the sky? It turns out they did- they went because they needed their spirit power to fuel the key in order to lock them in Shadow Tokyo. Mm hmm and now they're stuck there! Are they dead? I don't know, maybe, who cares? Sakura's not dead, so that's all that matters, right? You know, I just had a bad thought, because I get, you know, these specific thoughts on when I try to predict the future. Uh-huh. Uh, I have a strange feeling that us six, and, and possibly just Sakura, are gonna have enough spiritual energy! To open the gates of the demon realm and save the other combat reviews. Okay. Okay. That's that's my prediction. Okay. Niskodamas has spoken. Okay. 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 <laughs> but don't worry, they're not dead just because they never give up. Yeah, ten years though. Can you imagine fucking Rika? Ten years of constant war and death. They're not the same! Unless it's like some sort of time paradox and it's only been like a few months for them or something. They pulled an Avengers Endgame. They shrank like, down like, really, really small and went to the Quantum Realm. With enough clever writing, you could write past their, their, uh, their shortcomings, but... 
Why did they write the why did, why did they write it like this in the first place? This is really like to drive the point home that they're all in Shadow Tokyo. Oh, are they alive? Are they dead? Who knows? Haha, <laughs> you just gotta believe. You gotta have faith. You know, if they pull the fast one on us, and it turns out that where we are right now is Shadow Tokyo, I would lose my goddamn mind. Okay. Like, this is the dark world to okay. the, the other Soccer Wars games light world. Okay. I mean, that kind of explains why just demons just appear out of nowhere. Oh, it certainly fucking feels like it, tell you that much. Well, I mean, we met our villain in a random cutscene and then things started going wrong. It wasn't much build-up. It's almost oh. like people knew it was going to happen. Oh, what's this? The president is making an announcement about the games. Who cares about this? <laughs> Who cares about this? The, uh, the, the review members? The games, man. Check it. This is the stupidest thing so far. Yeah, there was a terrorist attack, but you know what? Fuck terrorists. We're not going to let them stop the games even though they stop the games. They're going to up the ante now. He's gonna amend the rules. Check this. Are okay. you sitting down? Yep. Because this might knock you back at how stupid it is. <laughs> oh, really? If you oh. lose in the tournament, you are gone. You are fired. Whoa, that makes no sense. We have uh, an unprecedented demon threat looming in our city. The only thing left to do is to fire everybody except my senior managers. <laughs> Meritocracy? Bullshit. You're destroying, like, members of different reviews from different parts of the world. All the other places besides the winners are fucked. What? Yep. Yep. It's like we're gonna we're gonna run the Olympics, but because of the you know it's it's like of the Atlanta Olympics, and because that happened, now we're gonna make it so that whoever doesn't get a medal gets shot in the head. Has to be a gold too, otherwise. Well, if you get silver, you get your legs broken, and if you get bronze, you get a lobotomy. <laughs> A fate worse than death, getting bronze. <laughs> what do the combat reviews represent? Pick right, pick right, pick right, damn it! Battling your allies is never easy after all, I mean... How would I mean, we know? We, we got, I mean, right right now we're in we're in a place where we gotta fight our friends! We met everybody and now we're lovey-dovey friends with them! We but have to face them assholes. and it's gonna be a fight to the... I know! I don't give a shit! I'm ready to kill! They, they are not nice people! Why should we, like, consider them allies? In fact, we should consider them, like, enemies! They're no longer the game rivals. told you to! The game told you to! You think you have any agency here? No way! Oh no! What's that? You wanna pick you you wanna pick your favorite girl? Nah, you want Sakura! That's right, because y'all want Sakura, we can tell. <laughs> Is this a science experiment? Like if I try to pick another girl and get zapped by a collar? Do you want to see all your friends from the from the past Sakura Wars, <laughs> you know, back back finally? No, of course you don't. No, of you, course you, not. You, no. You want you want to move on. I want the old in with the new, right? Yeah, that's how you are. Hi, Claris. Hi. <laughs> uh, 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 okay. Uh, these hi. these guys aren't assholes who tried to kill you. They're your friends. Look, they even make you delicious rice. No, not just that. The best goddamn rice you've ever had. Am I asleep right now? Hold on, let me pinch myself. Ow. Okay, no, I'm not sleeping. 
So this is the reason why we're not doing the games today, because a major development just happened, and now everybody's got to react. Oh, things are different now. I can't believe it. That really? it's gonna be so brutal. I really? just can't. I just can't believe it. Oh, oh no! <laughs> oh no! Thanks, Azami. <laughs> oh, so this is basically a filler episode. Yeah! God <laughs> damn it! <laughs> oh god, how long is this? Oh Jesus! But we got bromides to get. Check oh, it. That's good. What we got here? It's Mel and C. They're dead. <laughs> <laughs> They're dead. No! They're in Shadow Tokyo. They one got mauled by a demon. The other fell down a cliff. They're dead. Hey, a lot can happen in 10 years! You know, four kids had something when it came up with the Shadow Realm. That was completely, like, off the cuff. So it, so it's like their people had a chance to come back when they got banished in Yu-Gi-Oh! Instead of, you know, just dying. Look, I can see their parachutes. They're okay. <laughs> but who cares about those two? I mean, after all, we're talking with Sakura now. She's sad. Niskel, Sakura is sad. Uh oh. What are we gonna fucking do? I think we should make out with her violently. Well, you, well, well, check it. You decide that for yourself. I can't tell you to be better. You have got to look within yourself. You, I mean, you got the dreams after all, right? You think Sakura had a big daddy? Well, she kind of did, but uh, but I just can't. And that was the neutral answer. <laughs> what? It's just oh. like whatever then. Ugh. I need you to have a mirror by your desk at all times just to make sure you don't pop a blood vessel in your eyes. Oh, is that what that pain is? <laughs> Do you see red? Do you literally see red? Uh, no, but I am bleeding out my nose. Oh, okay. Well, that's completely different. All right. Uh, let's shop for another bromide here. Hey, Komachi! Everything's terrible! Wanna bromide? Uh, who are we gonna go with today? Uh, da, 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 uh, yeah, we'll go with Claris's. Yoink! Well, the bloom is so great you can't even see your face. Did that say she's fantasizing about all the plays she has to write? Like oh, she, you poor amateur writer, you. Is she, like, officially our screenwriter or whatever? Technically. Check oh. out a bromide. <gasps> Jemimine! <gasps> Woo, yeah! She's fucking dead. She's dead, too. She got killed. I, I forgot how. Nobody knows. Because whoever, whoever was there to see her die is dead. God, this seriously is the Dark World. Like, all these bromides are meshes, messages being sent across space and time. But don't worry, you gotta have faith. Cause they're not the type to just give up. It's been 10 years, but they're not the type to give up, no way. You mean our combat review or the other ones? Because ours totally gave up. Well, ours has Sakura Amamiya, so we're practically invincible. We, she gave up like five minutes ago. <laughs> like, literally, the last time we talked with her, she said she can't do something. She has given up. That's because she's sad, dude. Mm. If oh, sure. she's not happy, Nobody in this game is happy. Here, I will give you a great example of somebody who is currently sad. I want you to look in a mirror. I can oh, feel fuck. your sadness, friend! Such dark circles, such red eyes, such bloated cheeks. <laughs> uh, I believe a, uh, oh, what's that musk you have on? Oh, is that Betrayal? Uh, by Sega? Oh, uh, that's a shame, I guess. I wasn't even paying attention, so I'll just assume you pick the right one. That's about what I'm doing. Like, while they're talking, I, like, browse Twitter when I'm getting footage. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, and they're blah blah about their feelings, I don't care, and, oh, that sounds like something. Uh, 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 uh whatever, that'll be funny. Oh, that's so fantastic. I'm glad I'm not the only one. Okay, so I'm gonna look up uh, Sega CS2 R&D to see what other games they've done recently. 
Or not recently, but, you know, before this. They're basically Sonic Team adjacent. Because they have a lot of members of Sonic Team working for them, too. I mean, this That's... is running the Hedgehog Engine, too. The he Hedgehog Engine is probably one of the most beautiful engines I've ever seen. It's on really honestly. pretty. Yeah. But then they do shit like this with it and make it look ridiculous. Alright, let me see. Uh, do, 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 do. Nope, nothing there. Not yet. Well, check it out. We got, we got a scene with Anastasia now. Oh, I should probably pay attention. It's something new. Of course it's not a voice. Why would it be? Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, yeah. I, I found a list. <laughs> so, all right. I'm a physics guy, as you know. How are they able to see that many stars? The dark there's world only has one There's bright blinding world. lights everywhere in Tokyo in the 1940s. You're telling me you can see an entire nebula <laughs> of stars in the sky? I don't fucking think so. It's just a giant matte painting. It's actually not night right now. There's you no, can't see that many stars no in way. pizza. Especially <laughs> if you're in a courtyard of a brightly lit theater with street <laughs> lights everywhere. There's no way, and every single light in the building is on. <laughs> There's no way you can see that many stars. It's impossible. <laughs> the only stars are the ones I see in your eyes, darling. Which means that they're just here for the cliche. They're not here to build any kind of artful meaning. Oh, what I see, I, 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 I see your eyes. Yeah, don't go any lower. Actually, you have a very nice hairline, too. I really like the tone of your skin. Is that spray on tan? My god, your eyelashes. They look like gnarled branches. Wait, that works. my heart. Yeah, it did. It's because it's charming, I guess. It's it's kind of lame, and it's about like a C rank, but. Oh, I, I'm looking closer. I can. <clears throat> you have the most delectable crow's feet I've ever seen, Anastasia. But but here here's a here's a decent thing. He's talking about you know back in the old day. You know this is actually a a a, a somewhat decent scene. She's talking about the beauty of the stars. She's talking about, man, back in, yeah, you know, I didn't see stars. Yeah, you know, back in those days. Here yeah, comes it's... Sakura. Give me some Sakura. When's she gonna come into the conversation? You know, I'll bet who also enjoys stars? Sakura. Actually, it doesn't go into Sakura, believe it or not. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, I know, right? A plus C. It, it sounds crazy, but that's that's it. Aw, oh, that was really cute. I like that scene. Wait, it's still going. It is still going. It's like, ah, that's some good stargazing. How do you feel after gazing at stars? Oh, I am just beat. Do you see how many stars there are to gaze? I mean, like, how the hell can they see that many stars? Wow, I just need to look up at the sky. Thanks, Anastasia, for showing me I can look up at the sky and feel better about everything. Kamiyama, I'm glad you agree. Now, tomorrow you should look at the biggest star we have in the sky. It's very bright. You can't miss it. Okay! That was cute. I'm watching my favorite star walk away right now. <laughs> hey -o. Oh, uh, all right. Uh. So uh, I found a list of games that uh, 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 CS2 R&D have also oh, made. Oh, oh yeah, they're... I got a bromide. It's peppermint. Ooh! Oh my god! Yeah! I'm surprised they did that. Okay, cool. Well, She's dead too. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone is dead. Shit. So, primarily, this team has done almost every single Sega game in the past, like, ten years. <laughs> yeah. 
Hey, weren't we just looking at stars? Yeah, but we need another scene together because, you know, fucking soccer and everything. Perfect. I'll take it. Give me my star right here. Oh, we're gonna do acting. Yes, the, 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 the non-specific acting. Don't mess it up, man. I like this girl. So this is one of those uh, moments where uh, the acting is basically saying something like this. This is how you act. In the theater, of course. Alright, how can I have to... Da, da. That's the line? Oh, come on, Kamiyama. <laughs> Wasn't that low? It's time to bring out the hammy acting Great for this acting. one. So good acting. Oh. <laughs> Did we just undo the stargazing points? Probably. Don't worry, there's a couple more chances here. Alright, so, <laughs> definitely don't go low. Low is not what she's after. Her heels are teacups. <laughs> so, let's get a little bit uh, spicier, yeah? Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, right about there. Don't want to be too strong, just want to be confident, is sincere and honest. Oh... Okay. I mean, okay. Okay. More spice. No, what, it's a spice. Trick. It's a I'll trick. give you fucking spice. No. I'll give you ghost pepper spice, bitch. No, it's a trap. I will spice up my acting. I will be like Nicolas Cage going Ultra Instinct. No, no. It's a trick. Damn, we're done. Oh, come on. At least one more. Just so you could go full ham. Nope, now the game's like, Haha, now you gotta reload save, or you gotta... Or you gotta start a new playthrough. Oh, I just got shot by love! Well, oh, that was worthless. Yeah, that was. <laughs> Alright, what do we got left here? Sounds like we need something in the underground hangar. Well, fuck you, one ragey. <laughs> the vial that you I need hear. a guinea pig. Oh no! Wait for it. Oh come on! I regret talking to you. This is basically using the, uh, the lip system to do some, uh, fun technical moves. Oh, okay. It's basically a way of calibrating the Muga, and even though it doesn't move anywhere, we don't do anything, but trust me, it's really happening. So. Here we go. Show me the lips. Lock the output at medium. So, just put it to like 50%, right? And there. Yeah, go me! I can go into second gear! That was like our first good accomplishment today. Alright, max output. Push it up all the way. Say no all more, buddy. All the way. All Rah! the way. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Now let's get sexy. Set the output to 10% and do it within two seconds. Okay. Show me. You got two seconds. 
Here we go. One, one thousand, two, one thousand. Yeah! Yo! Look at you! You're talking to Seiji Okamiyama here! Number one calibrator! And the entire thing just falls to pieces. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> How was that all? That's easy. Thanks, now go out and buy more gas you wasted. All right, what next? There's so many things to do. Oh boy, let's start in the archives. Hey, Claris, do you have book on how when? Oh, oh no, wait, I forgot. We're in the middle of being sad about the games. It's amazing how quickly you can forget that about this game. It's just, oh, but the games, we're going to lose, and everybody else is going to lose. There are no winners, only losers! <laughs> Can we, like, fire these girls? Just get brand new women of the combat review? I would love a cast reset. I mean, can we turn this into a roguelike? Like, constantly re-roll different girls? Dude. That'd be kinda cool. Randomized anime waifus every playthrough and permadeath is crazy. Hmm. Look, Google searching roguelike waifu. Oh no! You're gonna get bad results now! No, oh, I spelled rogue wrong. <laughs> Anime roguelikes. Let's see. <laughs> okay! Does it exist? Well, kinda. Let's just say I looked uh, on the, the first result, which was a Reddit post. Somebody said. I would prefer if it had a more classic roguelike feel. I do not mind roguelites, though, so suggest those too. First person to respond, Ilona. Person responded to that suggestion and said, I googled this and I found child porn. Oh no! <laughs> so we're gonna stop there! Excuse me, I think you me meant to say... Lollycon, which is something completely different. I'm gonna treat this conversation like a pirated anime website and shut it down! Oh no! My free hentai! Yes, thank you for visiting me, Kamiyama. I don't know what we talked about. Oh, it's probably about feeling sad about how we have to actually fight to win the games, and so does everybody else. Wait, 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 wait. You, you almost lost me there. Are you saying you have to compete in games in order to win? Yeah, and now more is at stake, so now everybody's all sad about it. All right, who's left? Uh, let's get uh, a zombie here. We'll save Hatsuho for last. Uh, boy, really got to think about this scene. Oh, she's... she's vanished. Have you tried looking up? There you go. Hey, look, I'm a friggin' genius. You have two swords! Why do you never use them? They're actually Fisher Price. I'm sorry, Besides, Kamiyama. She's a ninja and she has knives. She could kill you if she just had a thought. Now, is that a thought like a regular thought or a thought like T H O T? Either or. Oh, okay. How is Anastasia still alive then? I don't know, I think Sakura's more the thought, because I keep telling her to be gone. <laughs> you 
You know, I, I believe by the end of this Let's Play, you are going to have a dartboard with Sakura's face on it. Holy shit, I just realized what to get you for your birthday. Forget I said a, anything. What a sucker on me a toilet sh uh, toilet seat so I can shit in her mouth whenever I can. <laughs> no, anime people are into that. So check this out. I just go ahead and play along with her ninja delusions, which probably aren't really delusions because she's really talented. And it goes well. Hey, look at that. Holy shit, you can. Alright, well that's a zombie taken care of. She, she seems to be uh, handling it good and alright. But uh, how is Hatsuho handling it? I'm gonna have to ask you check this one out. Okay, I am curious about Hatsuho. This is gonna prove why Hatsuho is the best one. I guarantee. Huh. First time in her room. It's nice and red. Nice and traditional. Wow. So, an altar in Mount Fuji? The altar should be a good thing to, to notice, it being probably important to a shrine maiden and all. The luckiest room in the theater. That's a good way to put it. She brings good fortune. <laughs> I dig her character song, too. I know, it's kind of catchy. But! Everybody's handling the announcement that the games are now sudden death. But she's a bit pissed about it. Well, yeah, it's sudden death. That means... dead. I was reading a Reddit post earlier. It's like, oh yeah, people, they, they just make it uh, life or death, and nobody questions this at all. They just accept it without any kind of, you know, any resistance. No questions at all. But hey, you know what? Hell yeah! Let's go get them! If they want a life or death, they're gonna get a life or death. Let's go fucking kick the president's ass! <laughs> yes. So you know what they go and do? Oh, they go right actually now. go there. Wait, what? They actually go and attack the president's headquarters. <laughs> Jeez. Whoa. God. Hell yeah. That is fantastic. And, and that was actually a good choice. Seriously? Yes. We got Wait. points for that choice. Well, I, I guess that's good. It's like stepping on a trap and it's a level up trap. Well, ahem. Good night. What a great talk. Huh, <sighs> what a day. What a day, I am just beat. I wonder what the battles will be like. They'll be the same thing, except the stakes are higher. Literally nothing has changed about the fights. <laughs> no, 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 it's, it's totally different, because everybody's upset about it. Well, get over it! Why is the president here? I thought we were trying to kick his ass. They're probably here to reprimand us for trying to kill him, and he's right under our nose! A zombie attack! Intruder! Intruder! <laughs> But go figure, the evil nasty president has ulterior motives. Holy crap! What do you think G stands for? G-Man? Yeah, loser. Goodbye. Mmm, I like the way your hair smells. Yes. Mmm, yeah, I'm, I'm liking 
uh, President Goodbye. Huh, the demons are looking for the Imperial Key as well. Wow! Was that good enough enthusiasm? That was good. Yes. So they are dead! Well, so much for the Soccer Wars 5 Let's Play. Oh, are they dead or are they not? They haven't... They, they, we don't know any of their fates. They won't tell us. Maybe we'll find out later. We gotta keep playing. Is that the one thing that kept you going throughout this entire game? Yeah! Yes! The old bait and switch. Uh. But you already they're, they're already employed by you basically. Like why would you want the best combat reviews to eliminate each other when you can just have the best, you know, anyway? If anything, I figure a recruitment process might be good. Find the best, find the most spiritual, find the strongest. Go to every, you know, cabaret club and theater and, you know, temple, whatever. That's how you get the strongest. And then you cut the fat from that. Not, not from when... Yeah, I think he's, I think he's evil. I'm just, I'm just, I just got a feeling it might be evil. We'll kill the... How do you make... How do you make we will kill the demons and win this war sound intimidating? When you're secretly evil. I mean, it's obvious. Clearly, it's obvious. And now we're at the games. Five days later. What? We could have had so much more character development. No, nah, who cares? No! My characters! Alright, it's time. Our first opponent is... Uh... Oh, actually, if we can get rid of the Chinese combat review, that would be a good start. Alright, time for our first match. I'm ready. Ready to kick some ass. I'm just waiting for this for, like, weeks now, basically. Chinese, Chinese, Chinese. Correct! Yes! Get rid of him first! Fuck yes! Oh, ho, ho. you guys are going down. I've got S ranks in my eyes. So, are these guys your first opponents no matter how many times you play this? Yeah, it's. Okay. <laughs> you want to know how it works? How? The first opponent is going to be Shanghai, second opponent's going to be London. Third opponent's gonna be Berlin. I mean, come on. This shit writes itself. Rip their heads off. Patience, Nisko. Patience. Although this does explain how we get to put these combat reviews onto our stage. Fuck Let's em up. send them packing! <laughs> these guys are going the fuck down! Yes! They didn't Unity. like that, God! Well, so What's what? that supposed to mean? So what? You can dish out as much hate as you want to me, but I can't send it back? I can't just say one little thing and it's like, oh, well, that kind of hurts, that's kind of mean. Ugh. You're supposed to be the bigger man, UDJ. Yeah, I'll be the bigger man as I crush him into the dirt! <laughs> <laughs> the 
There will be nothing left. There won't be anything left. See, I'm making the motion to show I know how to make fried rice. <laughs> I thought he was rolling craps. <laughs> Toss them dice, roll them bones. Well, obviously he is. He is here. Our team is strong. You guys are weak. But let's send them packing. Oh, that's too far, Kamiyama. Oh my god, is this an episode of Speed Racer? God, I'm so ready to smash their faces. I'm ready to break them. Destroy them! And then... <laughs> oh, you fuck off! <laughs> she smacked Sakura. Now we got... It's, it's serious now. Oh my god, Yui just smacked Sakura. Pay attention now. You went too far, Kamiyama. You said you wanted to send him packing. Bitch just slapped my girl! And we're gonna be okay with that? Your dreams suck, Sakura! Dead dreams, dreams, dreams. Holy shit, who wrote this? You could have faded to black already! Blah! 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 Show me you got the courage! Show that your dreams aren't just dreams! Have you given up yet? You can't give Say up! Cut. You have determination! Say cut. You're so Say great! Cut. cut the damn thing! We're done! <laughs> Alright! I understand your feelings are trying to make me feel better, now I feel better, and now I'm gonna use those feelings to help fight you because I'm determined! Is this improv? I don't what know! What do Are these guys bipolar? Why, this is why like, these episodes are, are so long, with? they just don't shut up! <laughs> now he's got a glove saying, I am powerful and I am strong and I am going to win because I am strong and I am powerful! I'm going to fight you and I'm going to crush you because I'm strong and powerful and you guys are not as strong as powerful as me, haha! -ha. Oh my god, I want him to slap god. Kamiyama just so we can get some actual tension here. Ugh. Jesus! Shut let's check, up! Let's check out our team status. That must have done something. Hey! Hatsuho's finally on the oh, third level! thank god! Jesus! Azami's still in the last place. Sakura's still in the lead. But it's still relatively early. Oh, man. Next time on Sakura Wars, we're gonna participate in the games! Finally! Get ready! We'll see you next time!